Hello, my name is Tim. I'm from Midwest Car Exchange. Today I'm going to give you a tutorial on how to start and uh, drive a 1928, 29, 30, 31 Model A. If you notice right here, you're going to have a simple, quick disconnect. Not every one of these are going to have this, but this is a nice, convenient factor. This little fuse, when you want to leave it off, just kind of hang it off to the side right here to get it connected. Just put it right back in the, in the port right there and we'll get a positive contact. We'll be able to start it with the ignition. To come around to the other side right here, I'm going to teach you guys about the fuel and the cutoffs in the car. You're either going to find a cutoff right here where the bowl is at, or this one does not have it, but you will find it here on the interior underneath the dash. So you'll see right here, my fuel will be cut off. And there you go, it's turned on right now. Now I'll start giving you a little bit of a tutorial on the inside here. This is your choke. It's on a spring-loaded system, as you can tell. So on a cold start, you'll pull this out, kind of level it off where you need it exactly to be, and start hitting your starter. Next, I'll teach you everything that's in the interior here. As you can see, you've got a footrest on this side, your accelerator right here, and your starter off in the back. Obviously, your brake and your clutch as well, your shifter, and your handbrake. When the handbrake is not engaged, it'll be pushed all the way forward. To engage the handbrake, just simply pull back. You'll hear some clicking and get some tension on there. To release it, give a little tug back, push the button down, set her on forward. Now I'd like to teach you how to actually start one of these. Simply turn your key on to the on position. You will see your amp meter jump up and down. Being that I'm six foot five, I am gonna be barefoot for this one because I do not quite fit phenomenally in these cars. So my gas is in the on position, as I mentioned before. My emergency brake is off currently. What I will do is, there is a spark on your left hand side here, your spark advance. And I adjust mine to about 10 o'clock-ish right now on a cold start. My accelerator, likewise, I'm gonna be about two o'clock on this one. Nothing too intense. Usually on a cold start, you'll get maybe towards a three here, just to get a little more RPM in her. So essentially we will have the ignition on, clutch will be in, We'll give her a tap or two on the gas, pull in our choke out, like I had mentioned, and hit our starter. She'll start leveling off for us. Set the accelerator back a little bit. Give a little acceleration at the bottom here. Quite simple actually. We'll just easily turn our key back to turn the engine off. It's just that simple. 